Hi friends, join us today on an unforgettable wild trekking adventure through the heart of the rainforest. Experience the raw beauty of untamed nature as we explore lush trails, encounter exotic wildlife, and navigate the vibrant ecosystem of the rainforest. The Makandawa Forest Reserve is one of Sri Lanka's richest and most unspoiled rainforests. It covers an area of 1,155 hectares and lies close to the village of Kathogala, one of Sri Lanka's centers for adventure sports. You can reach Makandawa easily, about a three-hour drive along the Colombo Nuwara Elia Road, where you can enter this tropical forest by taking the street that leads to the Kathogala Rest House. Makandawa is also the rainforest where the famous World War II movie, The Bridge Over the River Kwai. You could drift on a boat along the Kalani River with aid of a wooden, handcrafted catamaran. It is a great place to go hiking, bird watching, or butterfly watching. You can engage in several adventure sports in Kathogala and very famous for whitewater rafting. To enter the forest reserve, you should buy a ticket at the entrance forest department office. The map of the full trail is displayed here. Either you can do the trekking following the map or get the help of a guide. The full nature trail will be around 8 to 10 kilometers. The best time to visit is December to March. From stunning waterfalls to elusive animal sightings, this journey offers a front row seat to nature's most spectacular show. Don't forget to like, subscribe, and hit the bell icon to follow this thrilling exploration of one of the world's most diverse and awe-inspiring environments. Ready for the adventure of a lifetime? Let's do it together! Plenty of insect repellent and anti-leech socks are useful to protect you as there is an abundance of leeches on the wet forest floor. Wear a good pair of shoes, and a first aid kit will be helpful in case of emergency. Makandawa Forest Reserve established as a forest reserve to protect the watershed of Kalani River. It is home to many endemic flora and fauna. The forest is secondary lowland rainforest on the lower slope with the forest extending up to higher elevations, contiguous with the peak wilderness sanctuary. This secondary lowland rainforest has several interesting features such as crystal clear natural rock pools, waterfalls, and wonderfully challenging trails that meander through the thick tropical rainforest. The forest reserve is one of the country's wettest places is affected by two monsoon rain. It receives an annual rainfall of 3,505,250 to mm and the mean temperature is around 27 degrees.
The rainforest habitat spots most of the lowland endemic species of birds. Mammal species include the grizzled Indian squirrel, layered striped squirrel, and the purple-faced leaf monkey. The earless lizard, kangaroo lizard, and the hump-nosed lizard are among the reptile species and are frequently seen in the foliage along the Kalani River. Makandawa Forest Reserve Falls has several waterfalls such as Mako Ella and Len Theory Ella to explore. The streams hold endemic fish and many species of amphibians. We found hut to cover ourselves from heavy rainfalls and decide to take a break and eat and recollect the energy to continue the journey. When we reached to Kathogala it was quite late, we had the challenge to complete the trail with less expected time. Fallen tree branches, heavy rains, leeches, and overflow streams make the trail even harder for us. Travel is not always comfortable, sometimes it's hard and challenging. The dense vegetation, heavy rains, and generally unforgiving environment, jungles typically lack comfort. To have a true adventure, you must embrace the difficulty and face them bravely. The possibility of facing the unexpected becomes the very essence of the adventure. Without that risk, it would be a simple journey, stripped of true emotion and lacking the art of challenging limits. Nature heals your body, soul, and mind. A walk in the forest, you feel the earth, leaves under your feet, the snap of twigs. Nature's incredible symphony, with birds chirping, insects buzzing, and monkeys howling, blends with the wild breeze, rustling leaves, and soothing sound of flowing streams. Look up through the breaks in the canopy to the sky above. Breathe deeply and smell the distinct forest aromas, moss, sap, earth, and wood.
We reached our final destination at Thawatuna Walla Rock Pool. So thrilled to discover the rock pool with crystal clear waters and a stunning waterfall. We were truly amazed by the beautiful surroundings with thick jungle and beautiful cascading streams and really in need of dip into the pool and refresh our tired bodies. But the day we went had heavy rainfall that increased the water level and speed of the flow, do not want to take a risk to have a bath. It could be a nice experience to have a dip on a sunny day. Hiking is a demanding activity that requires proper preparation, especially when it comes to food. The food and drink you pack for each trip will not only influence you physically and mentally during your trip, It's tempting to choose from many prepared packet meals, but we advise making your own food where possible. There are several immediate benefits, including being able to monitor sugar intake and cutting down on the amount of packaging you carry back with you. Some starchy foods like bread, roti, or yams, sweets like chocolate cereal bars, nuts or seeds, fruits and vegetables, water, tea, or juice. Let us all make sure that do not throw waste into the jungle, reduce plastic, and use recycled reuse materials while trekking in the reserves. Be a responsible trekker to not leave anything in the forest. Take only memories, leave only footprints. The Kalani River running right through the jungle. The forest reserve receives rainfall mainly during the monsoon seasons. 
During these seasons, the Kalani River runs wild and wide. The rainy weather made shifting and gusty winds on the river. We trusted the skillful boatmen with many years of experience and knowledge about the river. Though it is normal for villagers to cross the river in this condition, for us it was quite an adventurous experience. We are thankful to the boatmen for bringing us safely ashore. It is the end of another adventure. I hope you have enjoyed the video. Please subscribe to the channel, comment, and like. Meet you with another adventure soon.